What's going on YouTube? <clears throat> I know this video is very impromptu and very late. Please forgive me. Your boy's been grinding, but let's hop into the video. Enough of that. Man, this is just a simple encouragement for everybody watching to just stay confident. And I really mean this with all sincerity. You need to take this to the heart because confidence is knowing that you can get the task done before the task is even completed. You know, what's interesting is Michael Jordan once said that, you know, a man is good and is one with himself. If he can talk while he's down on the scoreboard. You got to stay confident. There's so many things in life that you could be like, oh man, like, damn, that defined me. Like, I'm a failure because of X, Y, Z. Oh man, my life sucks because of S, Y, Z. At the end of the day, man, all you can do is just learn the lessons from your past and use those to step towards a better future. That's all you can do. That's literally all you can do. You have no choice but to keep moving on in life. And that's when I'm really starting to realize, like, I don't have time to be sulking. I don't have time to be st having stupid beefs with people. You know what I'm saying? I don't have time for bullshit friends or, you know, inadequate conversations. You know what I mean? Just stupid shit. Like, I don't have time for it. I'm, I'm too old for that. You know what I'm saying? And I really feel like in order to be confident in yourself, sometimes you have to go without. Like sometimes you gotta starve, you know what I'm saying? Not just physically, but also mentally. Like you have to tell yourself, no, nah, I'm not going out this weekend. No, nah, I'm not gonna go see her. No, nah, I'm not about to do this. Like, nah, like I gotta stay like focused. I have a better future ahead of me, but it is going to take work. There's no way around it. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm realizing. There's, <laughs> There's so many different avenues that you could go down in life, but no matter what you do, you are going to have to work. That's the most interesting thing about it. So it's like you can take the easier route in life if you want, and only you truly know if you're settling for less. And I'm just going to leave it at that. That's a whole video by itself. You feel me? Listen, you got to understand that this is your life. This is nobody else's life. Every decision that you make is going to come back on you. <laughs> so be confident in every single decision that you're making because you're doing what's best for you, regardless of what people say. And here's another tip too, side note, don't share your dreams with everyone. I'm telling you this right now because not everyone is ready to receive your dreams. If you have higher aspirations than the people around you, I'm telling you, you're gonna notice these types of things. You're, you're either gonna notice that they accept you and for what you're trying to accomplish and are rooting for you and actually on your side, or B, they're hating on you because they don't have anything extracurricular going on or what they're trying to do with their lives outside of just a nine to five or whatever the hell else. They're just staying in the same spot, complaining, sick, 24 seven. You know what I'm saying? Sick in the mind. I'm not making fun of physical sickness. You know what I'm saying? Depression is a trap, bro. Like I'm telling you, it's just like Cobra Tate said, bro. Shout out to you. <laughs> you are the one who is the only one who can free your mind <laughs> from a bad mental state. I can't say it any better than that. You're the one, like you are the X factor for your life. You have to do everything. And it's like, the way I look at it is, and I'm gonna end on this. You gotta look at life almost like a video game. A video game in the sense where there's a strategy to this game called life. Cause it is honestly really like a game. You get more tokens, AKA you get more money. You get access to certain things. You can go to shops, you can buy merchandise, houses, cars, the list goes on. But what a lot of people don't like is the part of life where you have to grind, where you're at the same stage because you couldn't kill that medium boss 
And then you over here looking all the way down the fucking mountains at that fucking big ass Titan that's standing right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you, it's just like in the Bible, bro. You got to kill the lion and the bear before you fucking kill the giant. That's how it is in life. You, you can't skip steps. The only way is to be confident and keep going forward. That's it. That's literally it. And that's what I'm just starting to realize, man. And it's like, I literally feel so much happier in life just from knowing these things. It's crazy, man. Like when your mindset changes to the point where you want to understand and you're just craving knowledge, you're eventually going to inherit wisdom. Because all knowledge is, is applied wisdom. What is applied wisdom? Knowing what to do and when to do it. You need to get on your grind right now. Because we don't know what's going to happen in the next year. We don't know what's going to happen in the next two years, three years, four years, five years. Do you have a five-year plan? Because guess what? Time is ticking like this. You need to take yourself more seriously. You got to take care of your life everything is up to you number one number two know your worth number three know your path i'm out